Singapore researchers have found a way to predict more accurately if dengue patients could develop hemorrhagic fever, a potentially lethal form of the disease. Until now, there's been no clear method to determine this. The new research finding may help doctors better decide who needs to be warded for dengue and who doesn't. Dylan Lowe explains. Aedes mosquitoes can cause dengue hemorrhagic fever. Being potentially lethal, it's one of the worst states of the disease. But researchers from Singapore and the Massachusetts Institute of Technology think they've found a scientific method to foretell if a dengue patient's condition will worsen to that state. The key lies in a discovered set of biomarkers, or molecular indicators from blood samples that reveal a path to severe complications. Say you've taken blood samples from a dengue patient. You put them into this machine, which breaks the samples down into smaller components. The components are then fed via this tube into this machine called a mass spectrometer, which turns out data for scientists to analyze. We measure numerous compounds, such as small and large proteins, small molecules involved in metabolism. We plow these measurable indicators through a sophisticated software and which would then help us distinguish whether a patient could develop or is likely to develop the more severe form of dengue. And results, which have been found to be over 80% accurate, can be seen in just two days. Doctors normally take twice that time or more to sieve out severe dengue. Typically, 27% of dengue patients in Singapore are warded. The discovery has potential to reduce that to between 5 and 10%. The result? Less burden on the nation's healthcare system better care for patients. It would be a useful tool for all the clinicians and all the hospitals, not only in Singapore, but also in the region, to identify patients with a higher chance of developing severe diseases. But before that happens, these scientists will do further tests to confirm their methods' reliability. Marina Square,